Good morning. The plan for today is to try and get a couple window wash clients. Also might do a run of recyclables and I might try DoorDash later tonight as well. Also, I withdrew another $22 from TikTok today. I made that on live last night. Uh, so we can add that to the total. By now you must be thinking, how many recyclables do these people have? I get it, it's a lot. But it was enough for another full run. The last run of recyclables I'll probably do for this challenge. And so I went to the house, I got them all packed into the car and brought them down to the depot one last time. This time I ended up with $29.95. So I went to Wendy's to celebrate. I got myself a junior bacon cheeseburger meal and this time they did not forget the cheese. Also got this Cinnabon pull apart thing cause I seen it there and it looked amazing. And update, it was amazing. The whole meal ended up being $15, but it was worth every cent, I can't lie. Anyways, the combination of the Cinnabon thing and getting a Joyride apron earlier gave me the genius idea to do a bake sale. So I went to Sobeys and Bulk Barn, picked up icing, sprinkles, and chocolate chips. And just look at this apron. This amazing woman, Lori, made this for me. Look at that. It's so cool. The apron legitimately gave me superpowers. That combined with the guidance from my amazing mother was an unstoppable force. I ended up with over 50 cookies and my mom also bought a dozen off me for $20 because she's just a legend. Hey, I'm here for DoorDash. Okay, you can park up front and wait by the DoorDash door. We don't hand out any orders. Okay, sounds good. Thanks. Around midnight, I got a notification from DoorDash letting me know they were busy, so I decided to head out to make some extra money and got a good few orders. I also went to go deliver some McDonald's and cookies to my buddy, but first I had to get gas. I was sitting at one bar, so I put $50 in the tank, and then I went to deliver his food. I spent $14 on his meal. He sent me $26.50. After all that, I'm sitting at $92.77. My gas tank is also three quarters full, so we are in good shape right now. Um, I'm just hoping the next couple of days I can stack up a bit more money so I have enough to at least get to Porta Basque. That's first, first order of business. And then hopefully also get enough for a tank of gas when I get to Sydney as well. That would be ideal. But yeah, yeah, I'm definitely going to sleep now. It's 2.45 a.m. So good night. I'll see you tomorrow.